the next step, we will need to purchase a domain. And I bought my domain from popbun.com. Uh, there are a lot of places where you can buy domains and compare prices even. Um, for me, I am using popbun. The steps um, should be the, more or less the same, just where you find the settings page. In the domain management, the only thing that we have to set up is the name servers, which is this part over here. As you can see, I've already added them in for myself. But if not, just press edit, copy and paste the name servers in and click submit. Do note that it would take up to 48, 48 hours as it says over here to propagate. You can check it with a DNS tool, which I will link below to see if your domain is propagated to the servers worldwide. And how to find the name servers? Since I am using DigitalOcean, I would Google DigitalOcean name servers and it brought me to this page. Similarly for other um, cloud providers, just replace DigitalOcean with whatever you are using, Node, um, GCP, to get the name servers. And if you are using one of the registrars listed here, then they gave they yeah, they will give you a detailed guide. But Pogban is not inside this tutorial, and it's okay. What we just need is these three name servers. Let's copy it and copy it here. Press after configuring on the domain page. We have to do some configurations on the cloud provider side. For us, that would be in on DigitalOcean. So when you log in, on the left side, you see Manage and click on Networking. This is where you add the domain name. So you let them know what domain to point to. Um, why do you just put your domain name in and the project that you want to put it in, press add domain. Alright, now that it is added, we have to create a new record and we just have to focus on the A record. Put an add so whenever the user types in just your domain name, it will, they will be directed to the Flask app. And next is the IP address, so the IP address that you log in with to SSH, that is the one. Drop it down and choose the correct one. Click create record. Next, we are going to do for the www, so whenever the user types www, dot the domain, it works, same thing, and let's get back to it.